You've got the core. I've got the timeline. Are yeah, you? I have both. But we're, we're at fractions, telling time, money. So I went ahead and page marked the core content. But we've covered, I mean, we've we've taught a lot of this with the base 10 blocks, the number mm -hmm. lines. The number grids. The number grids, right. Mm -hmm. And then we had two one one, which also standard units of length, measurement, half inch, centimeters, mm -hmm. we've gotten that. The two things, and then there was two two one, which was describe, design, define, and give examples, real world mathematic problems, like the standard measurement, which is what we did with those little animal cards. But the two I don't think we've really hit yet are 113 and 216, which are comparing. We've done the comparing ordering whole numbers. Yeah. But then there's, and we've done the money, but there's um, comparing fractions. Mm -hmm. We haven't done that. We haven't compared fractions. And there is 216. I'll find the lesson that we need. Yeah. 216 also is um, estimating weight Here length we and things like that but we have not done perimeter nope. we have not done area what There's about nine seven I have, I have a comparing fractions one okay what? so congruent, there that goes congruent. with yeah we talked about congruent so that one is I don't think we hit it enough I haven't hit it yeah no. I mean we hit it a little for which bit one congruent we haven't I don't feel like I on which standard well I'm looking at the timeline I'm not sure what standard it's on let me see I think we should one definitely one three. Do one three. Maybe. One one three. No, I think it's in the threes. They need to compare. Show me what you're looking. Oh, you're. Geometry. You're back on week twenty-seven through thirty. Thirty to thirty-two. Me are you? When we come back, we should be on week thirty-one. You haven't done that yet. The congruent. Mm -mm. I mean, oh, I, you know what? I wonder. It, is this the newest timeline? I think this, yeah, yeah, 2010, 2011. Mm -hmm. okay. So yours that one. Okay. Well, I definitely well, think for the fraction there's one, nine six fractional, fractional parts ones. of the whole. Yeah. That's going more into fourths and thirds and halves, mm -hmm. and then nine seven is when we're actually mm -hmm. comparing them. Yeah. Okay. So and I know some good resources online to compare fractions. Right. So I think Monday, Tuesday can um, be nine six, nine seven. That mm -hmm. uh, super math worksheets are the other one. Um, has where they can um, print off the bars, which they have it here. Yeah, it's in the Math Masters. The oh, one yeah, right here. Where yeah. It tells and then they can and mash them up and everything. And then we can, you really hit on numerator and denominator too, mm -hmm. which we've hit on, but not yeah. enough. No. Yeah. You know what I need for um, and there's the my uh, the with the, that page struggling? Is I need on 9 6 where they're comparing fractions, mm -hmm. but they're the same. You look here like a half but the halves but the yeah. halves but because they different. look different because mm -hmm. they look different mm -hmm. i think that my the mm -hmm. ones that are struggling i need to focus on that right and that would be a good time mm -hmm. okay so it looks like nine six through nine eight is naming fractional parts and doing things with fractions which i think yeah we, i think we, we need, need to hit more yep right. definitely so that would be three math lessons that we can plug into um we still need one more what's, what's the last here. one we want to hit uh the last well it was the perimeter and area which maybe we should do. We could also make up a lesson where we're doing um, more greater than, less than with fractions. Right. Mm -hmm. With the compare, that was part of it. Mm -hmm. So we could do that as an equal um, to. That would be a Thursday lesson. Mm -hmm. So we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Nine, six, nine, seven, nine, eight. And then we would do our own thing with um, greater, greater than, than, less than, than comparing fractions. Okay. Which they could use their strips that they used from a previous mm -hmm. lesson and save them. All right, so then now we, for this, is it going to be? One, one, three. It's going to be the actual fraction, like one half. Or like is it one half show you, like, because is I, greater than one third. Right. Yeah. But they'll have their. Sticks but they'll have their. That they'll they have their day strips day before. that we've used the, in a previous yeah. lesson. Yeah, there's they strips. That. Yeah. They could use right. this, and then uh -huh. there's even a visual if we want to print off ones the for like our lower learners that right. need mm -hmm. that need yeah. the visual to see that one half is more than one third. Yeah. Okay. All right, okay. ready? Start plugging. Well, the eye cans are right here. Right, ready? Tell me. All right. So for nine? We're starting at 9.6. 9.6, 9. 9. 6, yeah. Okay, I can. I, it's right here in <clears throat> the learner target. Right I can compare fractions, one half, yeah. one third, one fourth. Mm -hmm. Nine, six, Amy, can I see my book? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can compare fractions, and that will be our big yeah, umbrella yeah. for our differentiated groups. Right. And there's 
Mm -hmm. The objective in here for 9, 6 is to extend fraction concepts to fractions other than unit fractions. Right, but to put like there I can, like in their words or whatever. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, we could see I need the to put it in there. And then we'll compare talk about fractions. Compares. Yeah, exactly. Compare will be yeah. our highlight right. word. Yep, talk about compare. Right. That's what I usually do. Highlight. Okay, so as a whole group, we would. Math message. Which we have that, and then the whole group would be folding squares. Folding squares to make fours. Folding squares to make fours. That's Math Masters 267. Okay. We're on the 9 6 day? Mm -hmm. Yes. Folding squares to make fours. And um, then we would do a lot of discussing where there would be okay. squares and labeling it. Mm hmm. Um, and showing them also thirds. how in different ways, different ways, yeah, to mm -hmm. make half, fourth, because so they already kind of did that, but they're actually folding them, making them. Yeah. It. It's more hands on mm -hmm. instead of just it's the drawing yeah. on the slate. And so that mm -hmm. could be part of our assessment too, is if they can fold it, to fold make, it, and make fourths and make like thirds, which yeah. is kind of not an I can to really hit this, but to see if they've learned it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, from before, like a flash. Yeah, back. Mm -hmm. kind of like a yeah. flashback. Yeah. yeah. All right. Okay, so, so we'll be discussing. So make fourths, compare. We will be comparing um, fractional parts in that too. Right. So compare. <clears throat> okay, and then we break into our small group. Yeah. Yep. It, yeah. Jenny, do you have on for the comparing fractions, the half, third, and fourth is for the whole group? Compare, I put folding squares to make fourths. Yeah, because half thirds, we can go into half higher. thirds and fourths. Perfect. Because then with the higher kids, we could go into like they have eighths on here. Yeah. And mm -hmm. Six, different things like eighths, that. Break it tenths. Six. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Right. Okay. Okay. Folding squares to make. Okay. Math Master two sixty seven. Compare fractional okay. parts. Then we're gonna get into our differentiated stuff. All right. They have a neat activity in the book, in the journal for the pattern book. Higher group, breaking in. Use pattern blocks to divide each shape into equal parts. For all the parts, use your pattern top block template. Shade parts of the shape. I think that might even be more of a yeah, I think average, average, average group. Yeah. Average group. I bet my group. Yeah. Um, because it doesn't get into the eighths. Two. Two or three, yeah. I bet. They would like I that. I put that in the average one, yeah. Because I it's visual, it's hands-on. I yeah. think both my two and three could do that. Yeah, same here. Mine what are they comparing too. fractions? That's what we want them to be doing. On these, mm. they're not really comparing. No. It's no, them. it's dividing them into dividing equal them. pieces. They're not actually comparing equal parts. them to see. Okay, well, we better see what's on the website then. <clears throat> then that wouldn't go with any of this, mm -mm. except for the part where they fold the paper as a whole group. Although you could have the higher group then do page seven seventy out of the book, the teacher manual, but you'd have to sit with that group. And do where they break it into the eighths and higher pieces. Five eighths. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Is that the exam? Yeah. At the right bottom, there. right, right. Okay, so in super math, super math, we have our basic fractions. Here's some fraction strips and that's that where we I, could use that's out of. That's where I found that. We could use it here or through the book. What do we want to do? Just make those, then that I way like we don't those. have to go make and a look, copy. I like twelve. This. The twelve. That's yeah, awesome. That That'll be perfect. Right. Yeah. And then, I mean, I might even cut that in half. And, and not low, the high, my, lower kids don't not need even to have them. Them. Right. I don't need yeah. to. But our higher kids maybe only get the bottom half. Yeah. yeah. Well, I don't know. I think it's no. Some they of would them need have to the, see that whole. That's true. The top part they would use for your whole group. Yeah. We need them for everybody. No, but. What nine, oh, nine, six. Six. nine six. Okay. And, and that would be and a whole group. Everybody, yeah. yeah. So we want to be comparing fractions. I wonder what we could do with this. That would be something good. We could make. Our... Yes, and thirds. It looks Keep like they're up. all just, yeah, it looks like they're all we just have to to put different them. ones. You know what yeah. I wish that we had? That would be good for our could... chomper one. Are greater than less than. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have a fraction uh, domino thing, memory game. I have all that kind of stuff. I have a lot of. I wish there stuff was something where you could lay it over top of, like a. You can with these. Do you know what I mean? Like you can take it, cut them apart, 
and you can put them like how many ace we could make do that a, on a smart board make them you know what i'm saying yeah. i did that one year and i bought that foam stuff and i made my own and then i showed the kids on the overhead how to that's what i mean on the mm -hmm. overhead like mm -hmm. you can lay them on top and you could see where maybe yeah. one's and we red and then, smart yeah right yeah i would do it on the overhead mm -hmm. so would i because we don't have smart board. exactly <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, nice. <laughs> okay, so we want to. So is in. the school going to provide us with um, overhead tiles, fraction overhead tiles? I think we have some. Do we have no, some? I don't have any. I do. I know yeah. I don't. I have them. If I do, I'm no glue right I got rid of a lot. Okay. Okay. I do. Comparing I have fractions. Them. So how are we going to do this? That's all I can. Okay. And there's nothing on that one. Not the really. super math. I mean, there's like what portion what portion is shaded. Um, I have a game I've been doing with mine that pizza fraction game. Um, Katie has all my fraction stuff. I need to get it from her. Mm -hmm. I have a whole basket full of it. I'm gonna have to ask her for it. Because it's fun. Because it's like the memory. It's like a concentration game. They pick it up, and that's more. That's not comparing though. That's more matching. Like what part is shaded and then the fraction part. You know what, if we're stuck on this See, one, why don't we do the next one and come back to it? You know what, they could color each of these a different color. <clears throat> right. Too. Like red, orange, yellow, mm -hmm. blue, purple, whatever. Yeah. So the next one, we'll come back to this lesson. And we'll yeah. see. We may be able to knock it out though, because 9.7 is comparing fractions. And this lesson I like better because it's introducing numerator and denominator. And this and is where we more. have the strips. So I really think nine six we can cut out because this is comparing fractions. Yeah. Well, this was this one is where you're supposed to do like one fourth. How many how one, many, how many pieces are that are one fourth are would make one up half. one half piece? Mm -hmm. Or what not? So we can knock out nine six and just do nine seven because that's what I think so. And nine seven is also using the Put greater than less than put this right. transparency. Mm -hmm. I would go ahead it. and do that. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay. Yeah, that would be perfect. All right, so you we're going to cut out nine, se not, this will be nine seven. Seven. Yeah. I okay. Can so Monday. change this to for nine Monday. seven. Do we want, yes. Do we still want to fold squares and compare? Do we yes. not want yes. to? Yes. No, I think that's good. They I need think, to do that. Yeah, I think they need to do that. Because it's more of okay. a hands-on. So they'll be folding squares. Right, whole group. Um, compare fractional parts. They would be um, numerator, denominator. Mm-hmm. And I'll see what kind of games I have, and we can like. I can show you. I have this game that might. And be can you good. change at the top nine seven when you get a chance? We've yeah. been doing this. Yeah, I saw you doing that the other day. My kids yeah. were so good when we did this. You know what else I've done too is brought in cookies or uh, Hershey bars. I've done Hershey bar fractions. Mm -hmm. This has like the pieces are labeled. Uh huh. But it has the one third, one fourth. One half, That's but good, it goes up to one twelve, one sixteen. Over top of it, and then well, like we talked about, when your denominator is bigger, your piece is smaller. Mm -hmm. When your denominators start getting smaller, the pieces get bigger, bigger. kind of thing, and compared them. That's a good visual. That's a yeah. Good so yes, absolutely. And um, then here's like a thing where you can compare the fractions on the spinner. I have a uh, foam fractions <clears throat> that I had purchased. I need to dig all that up. In the book here mm -hmm. on the next page, so I put that we would talk yes. about numerator and denominator. Oh, and this the next is page is be comparing yes. fractions. Yes. Is exactly right. what we could use to assess them also. Mm -hmm. So I think we should do journal page 188. 188 is whole group. Mm -hmm. As a whole, and they could use their strips. Right. Exactly. Right. Right. Yep. Okay. So in the strips, though, we're yeah. going to use fraction strips. So I'll write fraction strips. 